All right, so here's our Bright Local account. If you just go to the pin tab, Bright Local, it should let you go to the citation and locations panel in the top left. You'll go in here and see party host helpers. Uh, this one's for Boston. Um, it doesn't have all the reports set up yet, so I need to do that. It's only got one. Here's Philadelphia, here's Scottsdale. If you go to view dashboard, should have the reporting set up. Uh, you can see the citations right here, key citation score, reviews, analytics, all this good stuff. If you go to citation tracker right here, you can see which ones they have and don't have, which ones still need fixed, which ones have errors. Uh, so we need to clean all this up with them. A lot of these were completed through the citation builder right here. And you can see which ones were completed and you can click to get access to them. I'd probably maybe export this over to a Google spreadsheet. Uh, you can buy more, you can edit, you can view external campaign, PDF, CSV. So you can export to a CSV and upload it as a Google Sheet. Let's take a look at that. Uh, I just want you to find out about all the different opportunities for things we can do with them using Bright Local since we're already paying for this, but it's mostly like a management and tracking tool. Uh, so if you look at the citation builder here, Party Host Helpers, Scottsdale did that one, Philly did that one. Um, I believe this is Chicago, this is Boston. So those are done as well, so you can get all the updates in here. So I think all these were completed. Give me one sec. Uh, so now what we're going to do, we're going to go to, I just set it up for Chicago. So now we're going to go to tracking for Boston, view dashboard. So you set up the rank tracker and the citation tracker. Citation builder was already used. see these here and we can share that with the client. By doing this. Should send it out every month as well, but what we want to do is get a citation tracker, monitor citations, complete the setup of the location dashboard to see all in one place. Correct. So all these should be checked. Party host helpers. Monthly for each one of these. Receive an email. I don't really want it. And then the name at party. That's party host helper. Save that. Next page, you want to track the keywords for this location. So we're going to go here. Let's copy these over from this folder. Paste them. Check these boxes. Hudson, Massachusetts, yes. Track mentions. Here we're going to look up competitors. So let's just pick a main competitor. Staff, Boston. Okay. Who shows up first here? Uh, let's find a local one. Let's use this one. Then staffing by Josie. Copy that over. Copy this over. Let's get a second one. Service staffing Boston. Copy this one over. All right, next. 
and then it'll start submitting this for us. And then we hit finish. All right, then you hit finish. Hey, sorry for not And then you can check on the reporting by going in the top left. I'll show you in a second. So here in the dashboard, you can go to the settings. Uh, you can see this on the external URL. You can enable client access for Reputation Manager or an external dashboard. You can go over to Location Summary and have this center. Yeah, I think the center should be worth us. I can give you the phone number for that one if you'd like to. Um, yeah, because the center should be worth it. They here. would have the older models. Yeah, they would have like the 7s, 8s, 8 plus, which is something like that. Let's say for Philadelphia. Yep. View dashboard. Yeah, yep. It should be set up for monthly reporting. No problem, I'm going to have to reach out. To be emailed to them. Location details shows you the details on the location itself. Summary. Location tracker. Well, that's it. Thank you.